Presents too big for the tree So much shopping, there's no time left For my friends and my family Maybe we worry too much about wishing And not enough about giving Cause some people have nothing at all So here's my happy Christmas to you today's video I'm doing a holiday lookbook ish type thing but I'm calling this my holiday checklist because yes I am showing you guys outfits that I wear during the holiday season and my style for this time of year but at the same time I'm also just showing you guys my favorite things to do during the holiday season and kind of just like a little peek into my life during the holidays I had so much fun filming this video so I really hope that you guys like it and Christmas is almost upon us so maybe if you're looking for a last minute outfit idea or if you're just looking for some inspiration to get you in the holiday spirit like a fun activity to do then maybe this will give you some inspiration for that and I know I look like an elf right now plot twist I'm an elf I'm watching you Beth the elf is watching you so anyways I hope you guys enjoyed this video be sure to give it a thumbs up if you liked it and also leave a comment below telling me which outfit out of all of these is your favorite and without further ado let's get started oh no we're here evil So I don't know about you guys, but I am totally a last minute shopper. Leave a comment below if you are too, so I don't feel as alone. I may or may not still need to get a few gifts for people. Shh. So for my Christmas shopping outfit, I'm actually wearing a sweater from my clothing line at Airbostal. It is my little foxy sweater, and I'm wearing it with my burgundy skater skirt, and they're both super comfy and cute. I added some sheer black tights underneath my skirt and then also some very thick cable knit leg warmers that I got from Forever 21 along with my brown boots. This outfit is kind of my style in a nutshell because it has a fox and the color burgundy which are like my favorite things ever. Christmas tree time! So I think it's pretty safe to say that one of my favorite things about the holiday season is getting a Christmas tree and decorating it with my family. So for my outfit, I'm wearing a little overall dress. I thought it was black when I bought it, but apparently it's blue and it has white polka dots and I got it from Cotton On. And then over that, I just put a burgundy studded Cardi from Forever 21. And guys, I'm obsessed with knee socks for the winter time, so I'm just wearing my black knee highs and then I'm just wearing some little wedges from arrow they're super durable so I like to wear these everywhere and then my little owl ring so even though I'm super indecisive I finally found a tree Okay, so fun fact for you guys, this is actually my first time building a snowman. I've made snowballs and all that kind of little stuff, but I've never made a huge snowman. And me and my friend Ariana made one, and I have to say I'm pretty proud of us. So the jeans that I'm wearing are from American Eagle. They're just like a reddish burgundy color. And flannels are always a go-to fashion item for me. So this one is from Forever 21 and it has a hood attached which I absolutely love. And then I just put on this little vest windbreaker from Air Pistol. Or if you want to go all out, you can get one with a furry hood. Oh yeah, watch out girl. The shoes that I'm wearing are my favorite go-to boots from H&M. So they are super comfy and I love them. Now it is time to dress our snowman, and he does not have a name, so leave a comment below of some name suggestions for him. And BTW, the beanie that I'm wearing is from H&M. And here, you know, we're just whipping out our ninja moves, having a snowball fight. You do not want to get in a snowball fight with me. <laughs> just kidding. 
So if you live where it snows, then I'm sure you deal with days where you're snowed in and you don't want to go anywhere because it's too cold outside. So even though it doesn't snow where I live, I still have those days where it's super cold or I just want to stay in for the day and kind of have a lazy wintry day. So this is the perfect opportunity to decorate your room or spend time with family. Here's my baby niece Marin, which most of you guys probably already know her. But we were just decorating and we were dancing and we were just having a good old time. Ready? Ready? Oh yeah! The beat just dropped. We were getting down. Look at us. We were actually rocking out to the Fox song because that is Marin's favorite song. So I am a PJ freak. I love wearing comfy clothes and one of my favorite pajama items right now has been this oversized shirt that I got from Nordstrom and it kind of reminds me of a candy cane or Santa Claus or an elf, something like that. I don't really know but I think it's cute and it is so warm and cozy. And also it has little holes for your thumbs which keeps my hands a little bit warmer so I just love it. And you guys already know my addiction to hair bows, so I'm just wearing my little red American Apparel hair bow. So for a holiday party, my favorite dress recently has been this gorgeous one, which I got from Urban Outfitters. And it's like this kind of velvety, metallic material, and it has lace detail at the bottom. It is so, so stunning. And obviously I just added my favorite pair of sheer black tights with this. And my burgundy wedges are from Forever 21. And because it gets pretty cold on those winter nights, you can just throw on a coat for when you're outside. And this one is actually from my clothing line too. It's so funny and weird wearing things from my clothing line, but I love this one because there's also a bow detail on the back, which is my favorite thing ever. So here is another holiday party outfit idea for you. This is another one of my favorites to wear this holiday season. So I'm just wearing a plaid skater skirt. The material of this is very, very thick, so it's definitely going to be a little bit warmer than a thinner skirt, which I like. And then I'm just wearing this cream colored crop top that I got from Target a while ago and I wear it pretty much all the time. And then I'm just wearing a burgundy knit cardigan over that. And then my shoes that I'm wearing, I actually got last year at Forever 21, I think. And I think they complete the outfit very well. So during the holiday season, everyone is so crazy running around shopping and setting things up for Christmas dinners. And I think it's nice just to take time to relax and go on a walk. And I really want to encourage you guys to do that and just be thankful for what's around you and just kind of soak it all in. So this is like my take it easy really comfy outfit. It's not the most fashionable, but I love it. So my sweater is from Forever 21. And then I'm just wearing a pair of overalls that I got from Cotton On. I know some people don't like overalls, but personally, I think they're, they're the most comfy thing ever. And then I'm just wearing a red beanie from Net. Once again, not the most fashionable, but definitely comfortable. These are from Target, and it's like you're walking on blankets. It is perfection. And then to keep extra warm, I'm just wearing this big jacket from Forever 21. And the last holiday outfit is another slightly more casual one. This one is a little bit more dressy, but I think it's cute if you're going on a date or you basically whatever you're doing this holiday season, I think it's perfect. So first off, I'm wearing this amazing jacket that I got at Free People recently. It has a hood and it's a leather jacket with zippers. It is gorgeous and it fits so perfect. I'm just in love with it. And then to spice up the outfit a little bit, I just put on my black and white floral skater skirt, which I absolutely adore. And then I topped it off with my little owl necklace. And my go-to pair of shoes recently have been these bad boys from Jeffrey Campbell. And last but not least, to add a little bit of texture to the outfit, I'm just wearing a knit gray circle scarf. So 
Now for the last part of this video, no, I'm not going to be showing you guys my outfit or anything like that because honestly that's not important at all for this. And the last thing on my checklist is to give back. This is something that I try to do every single year in some sort of way. It doesn't have to be the same way every year. So there's a lot of ways to give back during the holidays. One example is getting a lot of canned foods or boxed foods and donating them to a local food bank where they give them to people in need and I think it's absolutely incredible. And I don't know why, but I always get really excited when I see the red kettles outside of stores. I just think it's really awesome, and it's a really easy and quick way to help donate. And this year, I wanted to give back in a way that I never have before. So my sister and I got a bunch of sandwiches, some $20 bills, $100 bills, and handed them out to homeless people on the streets of San Francisco. And just seeing their reactions to this, I can't even explain it, but it just totally made my entire day. And I really want to encourage you guys to give back like this, not just during the holiday season, but all year round. And you don't have to do exactly what I'm doing here. There's so many different ways to donate and to help out people in need. So I hope that this inspired you guys to do so. I hope you have have an awesome holiday and I love you guys. Bye. So here's my happy Christmas to you. Oh, hey, boo. Hello. <laughs> you tried to hit me. I, I just see you like running.